New video tonight from a packed weekend seeing the national monuments built in their honor to a packed gym welcoming them home. The honor flight of Southern Colorado is back tonight and our Bree Groves joins us from the homecoming after spending the weekend in our nation's capital with this group. These heroes now bonded forever through the honor flight, getting the welcome home they have long deserved. And one final mail call on the plane ride home, a big surprise, hundreds of letters that were dedicated to their service and sacrifice. We are gonna rectify that today. We have mail call for every one of you. Thank you. Family, friends, people I've never heard from. <laughs> uh, one is Hick from Hickenlooper, and the other is from the mayor of Colorado Springs. Jerry Johnson. Dear Papa Gary, I hope this letter finds you well and fills your day with a bit of joy. I'm writing to you with immense pride and admiration. Where's Bernard? Okay. Back there? Well, you guys have just overwhelmed us. Why do you keep doing that? <laughs> In a good way. Yes. Waited for letters from home for sure. I mean, it's the only thing to keep you going. Things that we saw out there, uh, especially those that didn't come up. It's very kind of emotional experience. Without you, our country would be a very different place. And I look forward to hearing all about your journey and seeing the joy and the pride that it brings to you. Look at him. Thank you for your service to our country. Both my husband and I have served in the U.S. Air Force. One of the best things that ever happened to me. My dad would have loved it. He would have loved this. Hi, Roger. Cherry on top of the screen. Oh, oh, you bet. And what a privilege it has been of mine to help document this trip for these heroes. And we have so many more stories to come. But for now, we are back in Colorado Springs with Mission 19. I'm Bree Groves for News 5. All right, Bree, thank you. You can catch all the coverage from this flight and past honor flights at our website at KOAA.com.